It had been raining hard for weeks. Toby was feeling miserable. Everywhere was wet, wet, wet. His branch line runs through a village. The water in the river had risen with the rain. Only the great wall known as a dam was stopping the water from overflowing. Percy arrived just as Toby was about to inspect the dam for any damage. Driver tells me it may be dangerous up there. Please be careful, Toby, said Percy. I'll try, replied Toby bravely. Percy watched anxiously as Toby trundled away. His journey took him over a wooden bridge at the end of the village. The river surged dangerously beneath it. Harold Helicopter was inspecting the dam as Toby arrived. Be brave, Toby, called his driver. We have to cross to the other side. The dam did not look safe at all. Toby was very worried, and soon he knew why. The dam's breaking up. We must warn everyone. Toby shunted back as fast as his wheels would let him. Percy was waiting anxiously for Toby by the bridge. The river had risen so high that the bridge was in danger of collapsing. Toby arrived. The dam's breaking up. We must find high ground, shouted Toby's driver. Your only chance is to cross the bridge, called Percy. It doesn't look safe to me, wailed Toby. It's our only chance, said his driver. If the dam breaks, we'll be done for. Toby was halfway across the bridge when disaster struck. If we go over that waterfall, we're doomed. Then they saw Harold, who swooped low and shouted urgently to them. We're going to drop a rope to you. Attach it to yourself, quickly now. And they did, to one of Toby's buffers. Just then, Percy arrived. Harold flew over to him. the rope and pull Toby to safety. Toby was safe at last. When the floods were over and the dam mended, the villagers had a big party for Toby, hosted by the Fat Controller. You were very brave, Toby. Thanks to Harold, sir, Toby replied. I could never have been so brave, Toby. Oh, I'm sure you would be, but you never know till you've tried. Percy rather hoped he'd never have to. <laughs> <laughs> 